I'm having a sugar crash. And since I hate crashing and I'm going to go do some exercise, I better eat enough sugar to keep myself from, you know, having a pass out. I think that they are poisoning and dumping all sorts of chemicals and doctors are all in on part of the research to see what what happens to us and that they're they're watching you know for people like me who I've got symptoms you know and they don't even have a clue I think because they we look at all the genes and all that stuff looking for even look for defective genes man those oranges sometimes when they're old right before they go they go bad they're just really sweet I don't know what, what about this one. It looks good, but I don't know. It doesn't taste good, but it, maybe it's just a different flavor. I don't know. Yeah, it was pretty. The moon. The moon. It's like every action in our daydream is all part of a simultaneous, multi-layered, multi-dimensional experience. From the orange stuck in my teeth to the orange like above my seventh chakra. Is there a coincidence there? And then what is this over here? Is this, is this uh, some kind of oversoul? Anyway, those oranges didn't even taste good. I'm going to go find another one. Maybe I should just eat a, a, a grapefruit. See, what is that? What am I doing? I'm exploring, I'm experimenting, and I'm being uh, creative in many different ways. So now, I'm noticing that these lights are... What happens if you take them off? Maybe you always have to get rid of it somehow. Then it doesn't work, so... Definitely we need another It's called a backlight, you know. So, man, I can't even see after I've looked into that light. So let's just go down below it. If I'm gonna, okay, be online and be talking about stuff. Okay, I'm gonna cut this up next.
No, theoretically this was wrong because I'm already eating two small oranges. Let's say I had a cup's worth. And uh, so that should raise my blood sugar 70, 80 to 100. It's good, it's good. Sweet and bitter at the same time. So good. Wow. It's like a major, a major dessert, you know, at a fine restaurant. When it's good, the raw food can be fantastic, you know, and it feels, feels good, tastes good. It's a true pleasure of life that's good for you. We're so used to doing what's bad for us or craving what's bad. <laughs> we don't have time to enjoy the good. But then when you finally can start enjoying the good, you know, then the bad starts coming. I'm going to take my, my angioprim. Where is it though? I better take two of these. Libitone Plus. You know, it's pretty hard to read it. Angioprim. Man, if it wasn't for this stuff, I'd be... And I've, I've tried to do without it. I've tried to do without it. And, uh... I'm about... It, it's, I'm in really bad shape. I'm bad shape, like I'm afraid I'm going to die kind of thing. Now, I probably shouldn't be using a plastic glass to be using my angioprim because, you know, this is amino acid is strong. It'll take a stain off of a, off 
of something off the plastic, off the uh, tile. You know, that'd be a good experiment to actually pour some on something and see if it gets rid of the brown. You think it'd get rid of coffee, huh? Go on my finger. Yeah, that should, without having to waste it, because this stuff is expensive. Okay, so we're going to do this. Well, it's not a half, that's for sure. I don't like to, I'm conservative on it, because I, I, oh gosh, I'm conservative, why? Because if I'm a stingy guy, I'm stingy. Well then, let's do a half, there we go. That's the recommended dosage. It's the recommended dosage. Well, I still didn't even take half. The other thing is it doesn't taste that good either. It doesn't really taste that good. But I find that the effect is so good that... Hey, what was that? An eyeball in there? Was that my eyeball? Look at that. Oh, no, it's not. It's the... Uh, what on the other side? It's that. Right. There we go. <laughs> and this is not even a drug. Yet the effect of this is stronger than any drugs that I take. Unless it was a painkiller, you know, a superpower painkiller. I do find that sometimes I get, I don't feel good after drinking some of it or drinking the whole bottle of it, glass of it. You know, which is a half a bottle at a time. And, you know, the recommended thing is to go to sip on the thing for the next two hours. And sure, okay, um, but who wants to run around sipping on something for two hours? I don't really want to do that. I don't like to think about drinking water all the time. Because I'm kind of dehydrated probably. That's probably another problem. Dan, that's, you know, you should be drinking your water. I should be drinking my water. But I wonder why the thing was hesitating. Because I got close to it, I guess. Alright, well, I'm going to sip on it for a while. <sighs> wonder what would happen if I put some ice in it at least. Let's go get some. You know, really what makes the difference.
At least this is butter, you know, and I've heard that it's the same color. I feel like like I'm being listened to.